spread from cell to cell. They simply knock down, if you will, eat up, destroy the cell wall that contains them, and then they go on to the next cell and the next cell and the next cell. Well, just like having a building that has no doorway. It's got a solid granite or, or brick exterior, and then you, you blow up something, you use some kind of a tool to break into mm-hmm. that area, you can get into the structure. That's right. the way cancer cell works. That's why the pain power is so effective. Anyway, in a combination of nutrients and dietary change, eliminating the sugars and the white starches, of course, but also taking the right amount of those incredible nutrients, Federico completely recovered from that cancer in three months. It was gone. Now, he was given only a few months to live, mm-hmm. a prognosis, rather. And the doctors in, at the medical center in California were so completely amazed, and they have been in that continual state of amazement. They wanted just to make sure of things for him to take a round of chemo, which he decided to do while at the same time using the nutrients. Now, he has stayed free of cancer, but the doctors also said to him that they knew that the chemo hadn't done this, that this was the case before he even came there, mm-hmm. right? And they, he, the chemo hadn't done it. That was the nutrients, grace of God. And they said because only from this kind of cancer at this stage, only 1% ever survived. That means 99 out of 100 would have died. So what they wanted uh, uh, recently uh, Frederico to do was they wanted to take a tour with him or whatever their arrangement. Want him to go on a a tour. They're going to go on to speak to doctors at different medical centers Mm -hmm. at different wherever they are to talk to them about what the miraculous role that nutrition and vitamins have had in his recovery from cancer because they totally acknowledged it wasn't the chemo which was given after he was well anyway. That's right. And he called also to get more of his nutrients and uh, also to say he talked to Dennis and said uh, everything has been complete is completely free I feel wonderful he has a full rich life as well he ought to have and being wise about the fact that having co- been in that position there's still a need for a maintenance of great nu- of great nutrients to keep him free and following along that line of thought honey is this that when doctors tell you that you're cancer free they don't really know if you're cancer-free or not because they don't have any accurate way of measuring cancer cells in your body. Cancer cells have to be in 100 billion cells before they can become recognizable. That's an awful lot of cancer cells. So if you have 100 million cancer cells working in your body, it's undetectable. If you have a billion, it's undetectable. But 100 billion approaches the level where they can detect it and find it, okay? So if you have any kind of a compromised immune system, holistic physicians always say, yes, the obvious symptoms are gone. Yes, you appear to be as healthy as healthy as they can measure health. But don't give up on your nutritional program. Don't give up.